set my world on fire You're my heart's deep All right, you guys, I've been doing this wall here. Um, so, I probably should have measured, but I didn't. All I did was, like, I put it up there and then kind of, like, traced where I felt the switch. I used an Expo marker to, like, trace where I felt like the switch was. And then, like, it looks like that. And then I used an X-Acto um, knife to, like, cut it out. And it has been working fine um, because... Yeah, I mean, it looks good. I just have to figure out what I'm gonna do up here, like at the top. I think I'm, I don't know, we'll see. But anyway, let's see how this one, hopefully, yeah, look. See, I think it's gonna be good. That's like how I've been doing it. Kyle said I should have measured. I did not measure though. I didn't feel like it, honestly. But I think it looks good. It's working out fine. So we're almost done, and then I gotta do the top. Never up, never down, never Like a theme in a song, clever Feeling All right, see, it worked out fine. Now I just have to put a piece right there and then we gotta do the top. Up the corner there, I just made a line of where I think it's gonna stop. And then once I place it on there, I can use the X-Acto knife to like make it more even after it's on, but I'm just getting an idea. So, I'm gonna cut this now. Feeling high, feeling low at the same time. Feel so right, then I'm wrong, hoping I'll be fine. But I get up, I always do. I never think, I always do. Never thought I wouldn't jump, oh what a fool. But if I, I couldn't get it exactly perfect over there but that's okay because I always have a um like a cutting board standing up so I'm not gonna even worry about it um I'm just gonna leave it as is maybe I, I might actually have Kyle try to get that part when he gets home later from work um but I like love this all right so what I did was I took the sheet and then I just cut each um like like this is a sheet I just cut each row and I'm hoping that one row will work for up there. I don't think it's gonna hit, I don't think it's gonna hit the, ex, like the very top, but I'm gonna try it and hopefully it works. Um, first, before I use the X-Acto knife, I took off the top layer of film. There's like a top layer piece of film and it was just so much easier to cut without that on there. So, I don't know, let's try it now. Scenes, right? I'm literally letting her do whatever she wants so I can get this done. She's making a mess. Hi! We got on Paw Patrol and she's getting into the cabinets, but I don't care because I'm trying to get this done. Oh my goodness, it looks so good though. I'm excited. this I cut the the thing like with a um a big paper cutter I cut it and I don't like it so I think I'm gonna rip this off and redo this one 
because I do have some left. I think I have enough left that I can do that. So if I do, I'm gonna fix this because I just can't stand that line going like all the way up. So if I have enough, I'm going to be doing that. Um, so far, I think this looks so good. I'm so happy with it. I love it. All right, so I did end up ripping it off and it did make a mess of the paint, but that's okay. And then I did the same thing I did on the other wall and I'm just gonna, I think that should be good. But yeah, then I don't have that line. I just didn't like that. So hopefully I have enough to finish now. But all right, I'm gonna put this on. Sissy's getting ready for a nap, so I'm gonna, I gotta hurry up and do this. Never thought I would jump a There is like a teeny bit at the top, but you can't even see it when you're standing back. So, um, but I'll show you guys like up here, there's just like a teeny bit. Um, it's not covered, but you can't even tell when you're standing back because the cabinets cover it. So anyway, now I got to put everything back. to see if I'm gonna hang that back up. I think I think I might hang that back up. Um, and then I just have to put the toaster back and clean off this counter. But I, seriously, I love this. Um, I'm gonna go put the baby down first before I finish, but it looks so good, I'm obsessed. Hey guys, it is morning. Here is what this looks like in our kitchen. You guys have to tell me what you think. I love it, I'm obsessed. I will leave a link for these below. This rug right here is also from Amazon. I love it. Um, but anyway, what do you guys think? You have to let me know what you think. So this morning, oh, let me give you a better look close up. There you go. It actually does look like top. Um, I just had my coffee, but I'm gonna have another one. So I'll share with you guys what I got. All right, so I got this mason jar. It's a glass mason jar pitcher from Amazon. And it came with this filter that you put inside. Um, I filled this with half coffee, like half of this with coffee. Put it in here with water, filled it up. And then let it sit in the fridge for like, probably like a little over 24 hours. It is so good. It tastes better than me even like making it in my um, coffee thing over ice. And it tastes better than like the stoke or any kind of like cough the starbucks like any kind of coffee you can get like it is so good it's really good you guys so i'm gonna keep doing this i literally don't think i'll ever buy coffee out i've been experimenting with all these different things and it's so good so today i'm doing the premiere and i've been doing half because it wasn't giving me enough coffee before let me see yeah i won't be able to add too much coffee to that but all right, so the premiere's in there, cookies and cream. Now I'm gonna add some coffee. And then what I do is a splash of a creamer. So whatever creamer I wanna do, I'll do a splash of it. But like, it is so good. I will link this below too because it's so good. Actually, I should probably just finish it and then make more. I'll show you guys how I make it. So I did like fill this up about halfway. I didn't like measure how much, I just filled it up halfway and I gotta shut my fridge. Okay, so first I'm gonna fill this up with some Dunkin' coffee about halfway. Oops, I made a mess. I seriously just made a mess. <laughs> There's like coffee, coffee grinds everywhere. Anyway, I'm just gonna put it in here like this. 
Okay, just like that. And now I'm gonna fill it with water. Pancakes! <laughs> Hi, Cici! Hi, Cici! Hi! 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 Yeah. No, no, Why? we're not having waffle and ice cream for breakfast. That's like dessert. Sissy, come here. Come here. I have ice cream. Come here. Look at Gunner's outfit. I can't. It's good. Sissy, come here. Look how good she's walking. She's basically walking more than crawling now. So anyway, then I'm gonna put this top on. This is the cap that it comes with. This whole contraption was like thirty-four dollars, but it's gonna pay for itself because. I literally will never order coffee out unless I like I'm out and I want coffee but like I'm typically not gonna order coffee out anymore anyway yeah that's literally it I'm gonna put this in the fridge and then it'll get dark as it like sits now I'm gonna add a splash of my hazelnut and maybe a little bit more that's it just a little splash to give it a little sweeter because it's not that sweet with the premiere so and I like sweet so but I don't want all the sugar of like the hazelnut so that's why I do premiere and premiere also has 30 grams of protein which is really good so that's why I do premiere for low sugar it sweetens it up without have to, having to use too much creamer and it has 30 grams of protein which is amazing so there we go and this is like my breakfast it's not really a meal replacement but it does fill me up um, like for the morning, I'm not like a big morning eater, so there we go. She's trying to talk to Alexa. Say, Alexa, play The Blessing by Carrie Job. I'm going to play out Fire Me. The Blessing by Carrie Job. Do you guys know the song? She loves the song. She'll sing it. She says, Oh, here it comes. Are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> Sissy, sing it. Amen. Amen. Deacon, look at Deacon's tattoos, you guys. He's tatted up. Oh yeah. <laughs> It's gonna be a nice day today. Sissy's got frozen waffles. She loves, like they're actually frozen, like frozen the movie frozen, but then they're frozen <laughs> because she's teething really bad. So she's got those. Gunna's got some Wawa. What, what happened? Your straw got stuck? Yeah. Can you get it or do you need help? I need help. You need help. The kids were just taking turns giving Kenzie, her dog, um, treats. And Sissy's so cute, she says, sit, right? Sit, Kenzie, sit. Right? <laughs> All right, so they are having these. These are like their favorite. They usually have these. Sometimes they'll have, um, cereal and sometimes I'll have bagels sometimes I'll do eggs you guys know I mean breakfast food is like the same I need to get some more we're almost out great so um, this is our dish stuff that we use and I just spilled it everywhere because it got stuck in the thing dang it it's like all in there too what a waste. I wonder if I can like savor some of it. I don't know. It's like, I don't know.
eyes are warm Until you came knocking at my door It's hard to be This girl would literally be outside all day. She loves to be outside. She like loves it. They went outside. They're out front. They went out front, silly. Okay guys, so I'm making um, dinner right now. This is definitely just a recipe I'm making up. I've heard of like making buffalo chicken pasta, but um, I didn't even look up a recipe. I'm just doing what I think um, and what I have because I don't have that much for dinner tonight. So I added one cup of this Ken's Ranch. I added about a third cup of this Frank's hot sauce and then I added a block of cream cheese and then I added about one cup of mild cheddar cheese um, and then I took a large chicken breast and just shredded it up using my mixer like this. So it shredded everything really nice. Um, and then I went ahead and cooked up these veggie noodles and I am just gonna add them to this mixture like so and then I'm just gonna mix it all up hopefully it's good I don't know but I will let you guys know because you will try it then and then you'll know but um, I'm gonna put it in a baking dish that I sprayed I always do things like this sometimes I'll like go off of recipes but usually do my own thing it smells good I will say that um, okay so I'm gonna place it into this baking dish that I sprayed with a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. And then this is how I made the chicken in the Instant Pot. Um, I love doing that because it cooks chicken pretty fast. I had an extra breast left over, um, so I'm not using that. But anyway, I'm gonna put this all in the dish and then I'm gonna add cheese on top, the rest of the cheese. So total will be like two cups of cheese. Have it. I'm gonna place it in the oven 375 for about 15 to 20 minutes. I'm worshiping right now and then I'm gonna edit this video but I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys. I just wanna love